have uh, Takata 3 out here today. We have to put some gas in it. Mix up some 40 to 1. And then I just topped off the coolant because we had that coolant leak. But it doesn't look like it's leaking anymore. Hopefully it doesn't leak when the machine starts up. I tried to tighten the the uh, the, the tie right here. So hopefully it holds up. But we're going to be doing a race today between the Takata 3 and the Takata 4 which is in the garage. So it should be a pretty good race. This thing last video hit a top speed of, I think it was 62 miles an hour. That one I think goes, I don't know, maybe 65. Can't remember, but um, this one accelerates really, really fast. So it should be a pretty good race. I still didn't find a pipe for it, or the silencer I should say. So parts for this are very hard to find. So I'm still looking for parts and still planning on restoring it, just have not found too many parts for it yet. So if anyone has any leads, let me know. Let's just check out the chain here quick. Hmm, chain's looking a little loose. I might tighten that up a bit too before we do the race. So we need some gas, tighten up the chain, and all oh, the tires are flat too. So we gotta pump up the tires. Man, that's really dry rotted. <laughs> I don't really want to be going that fast with dry rod tires, but yeah, should be fine. All right, Chuck's gonna be riding the Ducati 4 over here, so he's home. We'll get that one out and uh, get that all ready to go as well. Haven't ridden the Ducati 4 in like at least a couple months, so hopefully it starts right up. All right, we got the Ducati 4 out. Needs a little gas in there. Just dump the. Let's see if I dump some more in there. Let me just check this one quick. Yeah, it is. Now this one's kind of, don't put it all in because I need a little bit more for this one. Hopefully this thing starts up. It's always a pain to start. These government gas. Oh, I know, they're so slow. Cans. Isn't that what they are? So yeah. They like spill or something. They're pretty bad. Ah, that should be fine. Okay. Wanna dump the rest in there? It runs for a while on fumes. They run faster on fumes, right? Yeah. It's like race gas. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Mm, dead. This camera stands dead. I knew I forgot something. Brought gas. This thing has to be a little loud. It's really loud. <laughs> I have uh, ear protection for it. Oh, let's put this in the trailer for now. You want to try starting this thing up? Oh, that thing? Yeah, let's see. I forgot which way. Uh, I think it's on. Choker. If you can find it. And this thing has to be in the middle, I remember. Thing. Try that once. Choke it. Yeah, choke it. First kick? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong. So it sounds like, like it's like not getting it gas. Like right away, but I know. I wonder if I should mix up some more gas. Yeah. Choker for a little bit. The white is so cool on this.
There she goes. Pretty smoky. Then we'll have them ride this one. Compare the two. Get the prediction down. This one's really fast. He's, he's gonna think it's insane. There he comes. Yeah. It's so um light. Yeah, it feels really light. All right, we gotta pump up the tires on this one, and then um, what else is this thing? Here? Then we gotta start this thing up. So we should get the air compressor out. I think this one needs a little. Did you pump up this one? No. How's the front one feeling? It's all right. That's pretty. It's pretty pumped up. No, that's good. <laughs> I wonder if we should let a little it. Well, that's probably fine. No. It'll be faster, right? They're a little dry rotted. I cranked my uh, my truck ones up to 50. <laughs> Jeez. I'm getting like 80 miles to the gallon. <laughs> that's good. Yeah. They were all at like 15. You pump these things up to 50? Yeah. Oh my gosh, those are like rock hard. The, the front right one literally had five PSI. Jeez. Because that was the one that was... You were probably getting like zero miles per gallon. Oh, yeah. Like screwing up my everything. Like differential and stuff. Yeah, that's... Transmission valve, like, shot. Really? Yeah. Oh, that sucks. It doesn't shift. I have to, like, man. Again? <laughs> Isn't that weird? You'd think you'd get a different... Like after it happened two times? Yeah. Nope. <laughs> it's pretty bad. Get some gas going down here. Let's see if it'll start. Do the honors for me. Is that thing pretty easy to start? Yeah. Usually starts right up. It's really loud. So you might blow like an eardrum, but. How do you know if it's on? Oh, it's on. Is it choke on? Let me check the choke. I think it's down by the carb. There you go. Try that once. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is so loud. Let's see if we can do a wheelie on it. Here he comes back around. Oh, there we go, there's second gear.
are your eardrums after that one? Not horrible. <laughs> Ugh. That's like the loudest thing I've ever heard. Yeah, it's, it's like right there too. How's it running? Pretty decent? It's not bad really. Is it opening up at all? Yeah, it did. Because it, it should wheelie right up. It'll warm up. But, um, yeah. <laughs> Which one do you think is going to win? That thing is minty. That's kind of freaky. I'm like, yeah. Going around the corners. Yeah. It feels like it's going to just roll. Uh, I don't know. What CC? Or both the both same? 250. Both Takates. Oh, man. Both liquid cooled. The same engine. No, this one's 84. This one's an 88, I believe. So this one's uh, a little I bit feel older. Like this thing's gonna win. But this thing is five gears. I think this one's six over here. So mm. gotta think about that too. Off the gun, I'm thinking the three wheeler's gonna win. For sure. The Kawasaki top speed though, I think is really good. So it'll be close. We'll see. Oh, I thought that was the shock right there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. Nope. It's got the pink shock. Yeah. Red tank. Huh. Because it used to be red made them a couple of years red. Really rare. Yeah, I've never seen them. That's no, perfect. they're pretty cool. Is but yeah, it runs good. Tires on there? Yeah, I know. Is that original? I think so. But the, uh, I think the, the um, axle is extended because that's a really long axle. Yeah, or it, it just it's has got spacers, spacers in there. Yeah. yeah, I think it does have spacers in it. That's probably what it is. Yeah, it's really, really wide. <laughs> but, uh, all right, so Charlie predicts, which one did you say, for sure? He's gonna go with the Takati 3. I'm gonna go with that one, just because I know how fast it is. Yeah. Um, off the gun, I'm thinking this one. And they'll pro this will probably surpass this one, like, right at the, the line. But that one will come away with the win. That one's a little easier to ride, too. <laughs> just a bit. Hopefully. None of our neighbors are taking their Sunday afternoon nap. Yeah, it's a little loud. <laughs> this is going to be a loud one. So hopefully we're all clear. No one walking down the road. <laughs> I feel bad for him today. <laughs> yeah, I'll get over it. That full speed is like, sounds like a jet engine coming by. But all right, let's line them up and uh, get a cool picture of it. I've never owned both of these at the same time before, so it's pretty cool. Both very rare machines, and uh, both probably the fastest machine during that time period. So, pretty awesome. All right, here we go. Two iconic machines. It's pretty cool owning both of them at the same time. Takata 3 and Takata 4. So, Chuck's predicting the, the 3. I'm riding that one, though, so I can pretty much determine that. <laughs> and then, um, Charlie's, you want to ride the 4? Sure. Okay. Unless you want, you want to ride the three? I'd have a cop on our tail. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's a cop down on the road. Hopefully we don't uh, get pulled over here. Um, for small town days in Van Dyne. But uh, yeah, it should be pretty fun. Yeah, and we can just say we're riding on the land right there. Well, you can ride four wheelers at some time. Town of whatever. These aren't registered though. Eh. That's fine. All right, let's see how sketchy this thing is today. Yeah, she's pretty loud. Needs to be in the middle.
Turn, turn. Totally saying it's way too loud. It is really loud. I don't know, this is gonna be a pretty good race. Ready? Look at that, baby. He beat me off the gun. <gasps> oh, man. That was awesome. You need some hearing protection? <laughs> well, if you were in front of me, you wouldn't have a problem. Yeah, <laughs> oh, man. This thing's fast. Yeah, was, I thought you were going to win. Yeah. First and second, you got you were taken off. And then I pulled away in third. It probably has to do with like, how I'm riding it, too. But like, well, how light it is. It's like half uh, weight, yeah. probably. It's like a dirt bike. Yeah. Oh, there's the cop coming. Yeah, that thing's fast. Yeah. What the heck? You beat me though, top speed for sure. Yeah, I was catching up. Yeah, cause I was I was tapped out in fifth gear, could not go any faster. But man, the acceleration on that thing is insane. Yeah. Yeah, I'm surprised. You were right. The. Uh, yeah, you were right that it this one would win. That thing's speedy. Yeah, it's really fun. It feels like you have a ton of power. If that thing hit six gears, it would just fly. Because it feels like you want to go up one more gear. Yeah. Do you want to switch? Yeah. Think you can ride that thing without ear protection? Watch out. Oh, so many cars, what the heck? I'll tell her that it's hop on. Yeah. <laughs> Be deaf. Let's see if I can beat Chuck on the four. This thing's pretty fast. Charlie should be wearing a helmet. I don't know what he's doing.
Geil, der BM, Geil, Mertian! <laughs> Got you at the end! Yeah, do you see what I mean? Fifth gear though? It feels like you just want to keep on going up, yeah, but you can't. I tried to shift again. I was like, you beat me off the gun though, bad. This thing's really sketchy though, top speed. <laughs> yeah, this thing too, it like floats. In yeah, it's like floating, the top. Yeah. <laughs> or the front end is floating. It's so sketchy. And I was like on the way over, I'm like, oh dang, Chuck's not wearing a helmet on the three-wheeler. He's <laughs> probably going to die. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, so many cars coming. Alright, we can head back. That was a pretty good race. Yeah, they're really close. This thing's really fun to ride. Pretty good race. All right, back from the race. The Takate 3 just blew by the Takate 4 at the start and uh, held its own when I was riding it. And I actually beat Chuck the first the first race. Second race, I was riding the Takate 4 and Charlie was beating me all the way up until like probably right here and then I passed him at the driveway. Cause I was in like sixth gear and I think he was in fifth. And I slowly pulled, pulled away. And and then got the win on that one, so that was pretty sweet. But both machines are running mint right now, and they're really, really fun to ride. Um, the Takaya 4 and Takaya 3 both kind of <laughs> feels like you're flying at top speed. It's a little sketchy, not gonna lie. But um, they're a blast to ride, but both very, very light. So it's interesting. Um, I would have not predicted the, the three to win, but uh, held its own and got the win. So pretty happy with that. We're gonna take the Takaya 4 for a little ride now. Enjoy that before we put it away for another couple months. This thing's running great, super fun, and uh, it's really cool to have both machines. See how she goes. Let her warm up for a bit. This thing is crazy fun.
too wet through here? Yeah. Feels like. Feels like we're about to lift off. This thing never gets old. All right, just got back from the ride. This thing never gets old. So much fun riding it, so light, really quick. And uh, just feels like you're flying. Really a fun time. Again, I highly recommend anyone that gets a chance to own a Takate. It's unlike any other quad. It's, it's insane. They're, just a ton of fun. Probably, like I said before, never gonna sell this one. It was up at one point on eBay, and I did get an offer of 7,000 on it, but I didn't take it. So, that's the race between the Takati 3 and the Takati 4. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more, and until next time, we are out.